the newspaper's archive, okay. Would have been published ten years ago. Great! Well, so we now want to head over here. To the Cor Cordona Chronicle. Hang on. There's something else it's alerting me to here. Hello. It's seen a lot of use. The blade is worn from grinding. On what? Plate out. No. Oh, there's something else here? A sailor's knife useful for cutting wet and thick ropes. Not chains, though. A coal gas tank. Enough to pump up an airship. on the blue. Okay. Well, you won't let that seem to say anything else. Um, so it's not the lock. Oh, hello. This is broken. Fresh signs of impact. A rough landing led to an altercation with this shed. There's someone else that was here? Oh, 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 catch up, catch up, catch up. So there's something else here. It's not footprints. So if I... So it's just something in this little section. The cue that the light picks up. That the, wait. Oh, hello, oh, there's something over there. Okay. Oh, uh, we're gonna try and work out what happened, I see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, right. I mean, that would make sense, wouldn't it? No, I don't think... Well... I mean, that's the thing. That's also a possibility. So we don't actually know. That seems to be what's suggested, but there is always the possibility of... I mean, we don't have any... To be fair, we don't actually have any... I think that's... Based on the evidence we have at the moment, that's what's most likely. Because we know that it ran. No. And is there another one down here? You're not even trying, Sherry. Concentrate. Okay, well that's what we have at the moment. This is what we have as, as evidence as the fact at the moment. Think, unless this is a different one. Oh, there we go. You're not even trying, Sherry. Concentrate. Okay, he doesn't like me because I'm I'm going like this. These this is what we. Well, this is the evidence. This is what we have as ev as the evidence at the moment. Is that was. Well, we, no. So we know that the elephant left. So we know that that one's the case. I mean, unless this is this is meant to be this one, but I don't think that one. That I don't think that's the case. Oh, that is case. In a fit of rage, the elephant broke the chain and threw its victim on the ground with a fierce power. Escaping the scene, it pulled the body with it, but dropped it at the gate. At least some of this was witnessed by a third party who was hurled against the shed. The elephant can't have gone too far. I can still track it. Well, suppose you find it, then what? Push it all the way back to the manor. Okay. I didn't even realise there was a third, per another person involved. So have I now skipped over the need to go to the thing? Uh, 
Um, yes. There's a witness to the chaos on Gildan's property. They dropped their knife and may have injuries from the fall. Yeah, well, there's been an elephant. May I ask for your assistance? That's a question I can answer. Elephant crossed the Greek bridge in the direction of the forest where Theodore used to walk it. Okay. Towards the forest. Over the, was it over the Greek bridge? Let's have a look at map while the game decides to calm down a little bit. Uh, I don't know where it was. Over. Right. Calm down. Calm down, game. Um. Tra its tracks lead towards the for forest. Hello. Ah. The elephant barged into this cart of olive oil. Okay. What if we're lucky and he slipped and fell somewhere along the way? Well, that was just a. <sighs> May I ask for your assistance? So you think if you have money. We should bow to your whims. No, sir. Okay, I was just asking you a question because you're injured. Which way did it go next? Or do we not know anymore? Because I left the queue. Um... Let's have a look and read this. Well, we know it didn't go this way. What does it say? My gratitude to this island will grow just the tree I gift to you from the most responsible citizen in Cordona, T. Gildan. So you would have walked this. Ah, ha, 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 ha. He did go this way. The elephant ran past. Okay, hear me out. If an elephant falls in the forest and there's no one around to... John, no. Yes, it does make a sound. You're such a killjoy. Sounds are connected to vibrations. There would still be a vibration even if there's no one around to perceive it. No, that was like that anyway. Oh, hello. Oh, we're going this way now. Okay. The annoying thing is they've made really they made it really pretty, and at the same time they kind of make you have to do these sections purely like this. Because this does this oh it does keep ah, okay fine. Up here ah. No, I was thinking maybe it tried to bash its way through there. Huh. I think I've kind of skipped ahead on this. I've because I didn't go to the newspaper archive, I just investigated. What's up here then? Worrying. This is broken. There. What have I stumbled on? Oh, this isn't a mystery. This is not a mystery, apparently. The fact that there is a ram sacrificed on this altar. It's probably one of the Hel Hellenistic gods, I would assume, if we're in the Mediterranean.
No, this isn't interesting, is it, Sherlock? No, this isn't. Why, why would we be interested in the brutal, the brutal murder and apparent sacrifice of of this creature? It's, like that's annoying. Like, oh, is this really interesting bit of like set dressing, and that's all it is. And it's like you you could have like you could have had that be like, oh, here's another case to attract your attention. But no. Let's no. Are we going up here then? No. This is a dead end. Okay. But the elephant came this way, didn't it? Didn't it? Oh, oh, oh. Noise. Okay, now I'm getting myself turned around. Okay. Where did I come from? I came from this way. Right, there we go. Thank you. Yeah, we'll follow the, the pa this path that it's only occasionally showing me. Okay, so it went up this way. Some water. Dressing gown. There's the dressing gown. Yeah, I think. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, wrong way. Here's the dressing gown. Strange. It was hung with care. Yes. The game has escaped us, for now. We'll find a solution to the elephant problem later. So the elephant brought him back. He was... He, I think he must have been killed here. Mate, no. Hmm. Dear Theodore, I'm writing to you as a fellow islander. I value our friendship just as I value the lives of our people, although I'm afraid this one-sided friendship cannot tie my hands any longer. I'm being made to look weak in the eyes of your neighbours. They believe your tree is a mockery and not a peace offering as you intended. The people are afraid. You refused to give your elephant a proper trainer and said using your own limited knowledge to teach it. It is an impossible situation. I admit that I did think of having the elephant forcibly taken and given to Mr. Tailheart, who has shown that he's quite capable of looking after the elephant Bean, although she is female and far less frightening than your beast. Please reconsider the situation. Ah. That changes... That changes things. So... They were trying to take the elephant, so he so ah okay so possibly what was ha what happened then was, um, Gildan brought him brought the brought the elephant here as like a final goodbye, but then the elephant didn't want to leave, which led to it its um, attack. I think that might be more likely, from what we know about elephants, which is admittedly very little. So I think that means we've done everything if it's highlighted in green. Just this area, so it might just be the. But we didn't. I don't know. Nothing else in the mind palace. Uh, oh, so that might let us get inside his house now. I think the other problem is it basically reloads everything after you come out of the menu. That's not great. Which is not great, considering you have to go into that for the casebook and the mind palace and the map. Da -da 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 -da. Oh. So, let's go back to the house. And try and get in, then. There we go. Maybe I should lower the settings a bit more. Thing is, when we loaded the settings before, they were just absolutely terrible.
Ah, so they've now blocked this off. Glad the police aren't stopping me from going into this crime scene. Is that oh Oh, is this Hog Heaven? Okay. So apparently there's some more evidence to find here, it seems to be suggesting. If that's not green, then. Hog heaven. Okay. Never mind. Oh, why do I get the worst jobs? I can't ask you about anything, I don't think. Right, well, we'll try and use the keys here. Okay. So it was his dressing gown, which is what we assumed. So something must have happened. So something. I, this is that should be in the mind palace. Something happened in the. Um, I can always recognize the spirit of a true artist. Um, there must. Have, so something must have happened in the forest. Which, because because he left his dressing gown there, and his keys. You, who are you? My name is Sherlock Holmes. Theodore Gildon was. Did you kill him? Did you kill the elephant? It's not in the yard anymore. It escaped into the forest. You can't let it go. What if it returns? I highly doubt that, Miss. Imogen Gildan. Please, I beg of you, find that dreadful beast that killed my father. I suppose we do need to learn what happened. It's an odd accent for someone who's a member of basically British high society. Uh, tell me everything you know. Can you tell me what happened from the very start? Let's not be brief. I was here, so I didn't see how it began. My father visits the enclosure every morning to wake up Goliath. Today, I heard the elephant scream. I've never heard such a horrifying sound. My heart stopped. I knew something was wrong. I looked through my window and saw how it... How it lifted my father up by his neck. I rushed downstairs. I saw it dragging my father as if he were a doll. I threw stones at it. It dropped my father's body and charged outside, screaming. Its roar was almost human. I was frightened, so I ran inside and hid here. Uh, Theodore played the fire. I, mm, there's something. There's something about this I don't like. I'm sorry for your loss. That is a terrifying experience, Miss Gildon. I'm sorry you had to go through it. Thank you. Goliath must be caught, Mr. Holmes. Well, thank you for the information, Miss Gildon. I did have some questions for your father. Perhaps you might help me with them. I wasn't privy to much of my father's life. And it's very hard to think of anything at all with Goliath still loose. Please, Mr. Holmes. Very well. Do you mind if I ask you more questions if I find anything that might help? Anything to catch that monster. Okay, um... I don't think... What have I got? Um... No. Uh, 